Live, late breaking. This is KMAX News at 10. It's okay for them to be out there, you know, celebrating or doing whatever they're doing, but please be responsible. A rideshare driver urging folks to take advantage of their services. One young man who police say caused a dangerous bus crash over the weekend probably wishes he had. Hi everybody, I'm Brian Mudd. Lauren has the night off. Thankfully, everyone on Abilene Christian's football team bus has recovered from that wreck. It happened in Lubbock after Saturday night's football game. Police say 19-year-old Parker Young should not have been behind the wheel of his truck. And KMAX Cameron Mendoza joins with more on this. Yeah, good evening, Brian. It was a close call Saturday night that could have ended a lot worse. Rideshare drivers are pleading with those who are wanting to celebrate after games to just plan accordingly to avoid hard lessons like these. Thank you all. Appreciate it. Thank you all. Just minutes after head coach Keith Patterson stepped away from the mic at his post-game presser Saturday night here in Lubbock. The ACU team bus was struck by 19-year-old Parker Young, who was arrested and charged with DWI at the intersection of Marsha Sharp and University at 11.45. Uber driver Tony Moreno passed the wreck while working that night. I seen it and I was just like, man, I hope they're safe, you know, that God is with them. Four people were reported hurt with a possible concussion, broken ribs, and bruises. They were treated at UMC and returned back to Abilene, expressing their gratitude Monday through social media. We express our sincere appreciation to the medical staff at UMC, the Lubbock police officers, firefighters, and first responders who rushed to take care of our team members and the Texas Tech Athletic Department for their willingness to assist our team in any possible way. Young posted bond Monday morning and was released from the Lubbock County Detention Center. We're going to all live by our mistakes, and hopefully, you know, this is an eye-opener to him and to the others, you know, that us Uber drivers were out there. Moreno Ubering to make some extra money, but also ensuring people have a safe way to get home, even if it's at no cost. We're making money, you know, to pay for our bills or whatever, but their life is, just like our lives, is more important than the money that we're going to make. Moreno says she hopes this is a learning lesson for everyone, that help may just be an app or a call away. In my vehicle, I'm responsible for them, so I'm going to make sure they're going to make it home. Moreno told us while she does Uber, she also will give free rides for those who need them after a night out. If you reach out to her via Facebook at Tony Moreno, she says she'd be happy to help those who need a safe ride home.